A new plan will make life-saving tools readily available across the city of Carmel, and officials hope other Indiana cities and towns follow their lead. Tonight, the Carmel Fire Department introduced its Bleeding Control Kit plan. WRTV's Amber Grigley explains how it works and where you can find them. More than 2,000 kits are already strategically placed across Carmel. Carmel Fire and EMS hope that these life-saving kits will soon be the standard across many communities in the Hoosier State. You never know when you will be placed in a life or death situation and minutes before first responders arrive can make all the difference. That's why Carmel emergency officials are sharing tools so that anyone can save a life. These bleeding control kits are easy to use with a QR code sending you right to a video for guidance until emergency crews arrive. In addition to 1300 kits already in public and private classrooms, more than 700 kits have been placed in public facilities parks, churches, and sporting venues. Not just for a mortal shot or attack, but something as simple as falling off the monkey bars on the playground. If a kid starts to bleed, you only have about six minutes uh, to really take care of that or the child could bleed out. So having them in our building in every emergency pack that's in every classroom and also goes out to recess, or if we're having outdoor class, every teacher takes it with them. So it's really important to have it right on hand right away so we can stop the bleed. We're not teaching them K through 12, we're teaching them K through life. So whether they're in school or at their job, once they've seen these, they've learned about them, they'll become first responders in, in their own right. Now, Carmel Fire and EMS bleeding control kit costs roughly $26 per kit. In Carmel, I'm Amber Grigley, WRTV.